What is the significance of Corona or COVID-19 in Earth's evolution? In order to understand the answer to this question, we will have to travel to the beginning of this Earth, in order to unravel the truth. Well, once there was a giant impact upon Earth, as early as 4,533 million years ago, the formation of Moon began. Later by 4,280 million years ago, due to the hit of several comets on the Earth, water started appearing on this Earth. By the period of 635 million years ago, due to the impact of so many asteroids on the Earth, there were formation of microfossils, green algae colony, trace fossils, and other single-cell life forms on this Earth. Close to the end of 250 million years ago, due to Cambrian explosion, early sharks flourished in the waterbed of Earth, this may be correlated to the Mathsaya avatar as per Hindu texts. By the end of 72 million years ago, the Earth saw the end of permocarboniferous glaciation and land masses united, that created Appalachian, which led to the creation of life forms such as dinosaurs, flowering plants, and insects. This is the period of Korma avatar as per Hindu mythology. At the end of 28 million years ago, Shiksalab impact on Earth, led to global warming, India collided with Asia to form Himalaya. The Earth witnessed the extinction of dinosaurs, growth of modern mammals, climate, and flowering plants. This is the Varaha avatar period of Lord Vishnu. By 2 million years ago, the Earth saw the big Antarctic glaciation, hypersalinity in Mediterranean basin and formation of Sahara Desert. This is the period of complete extinction of all megafauna, with the birth of all current day mammals like, horses, apes, chimpanzee and carnivorous animals like lion. This is the period of Narashimha avatar. In just the next million of years ago, Greenland ice sheet formed, Tobo eruption occurred and Zanklin flood exploded. All damages led to the rise of Homo sapiens and Homo erectus species. This is the Vamana avatar period of Lord Vishnu. Now, till this time we have been seeing that, after every destruction there was a continuation of other good realities, happening on this earth. To our surprise, this history changed once human were born. After the birth of humans, we will now see our history about what happened. Between the period of 2,163,102 BCE, 867,102 BCE, the Earth witnessed a 24-day of war between Parasuram and Bhishma, that led to the use of man-made weapons like Vyavaya, Guiyaka, Agnaya, Varana and even Brahma Astra. This led to an irreversible damage to the space, air, water, and soil of Earth. This was the first human-made barbaric act against life forms showcased on Earth by the human against this Earth. In all the forthcoming periods, the humans started empowering the Earth. Between the period of 867,102 BCE, 7,300 BCE, which was the period of Rama Avatar, the Earth had the most happiest life, under the leadership of Lord Rama. But, a 13-day war between Lord Rama and Ravana led to the use of powerful weapons like Brahma Astra, Prasvana, Gandharv Astra, Manav Astra, Varana Astra, Agna Astra, Surya Astra, Azure Weapon, Maheshvar, and Indra Astra, led to the death of around 10,000 elephants, 20,000 horses, and more than 15 million soldiers of Ravana. Finally, the war came to an end on November 15, 7292 BC. Mark a note, this period was the most cultured life that the Earth had ever witnessed, under the presence of human. And this era can repeat only after Pralayam. Before coming to the topic of Corona, we will completely learn what happened on this Earth after Rama's era. During 7300 BCE to 3102 BCE is the period of Balrama and Lord Krishna's avatar. The great Mahabharata's Kurukshetra war occurred on this earth with weapons like Brahma Astra, Brahma Shursha Astra, Narayana Astra, Brahma Anand Astra, Bhargava Astra, Pashupatha Astra, that led to the death of 393,660 elephants, 1,180,980 horses, and nearly 40 million human lives. 
even during this era there were mild emotional ethos and value of human existed. The earth saw the last breath of Lord Krishna, on February 18, 3102 BC, beyond which is the beginning of Kali Yuga from 3102 BC. We are currently at the 5121st year of the Kali Yuga. As per the current calculation, Kali Yuga shall come to an end in 428,899 CE. The other catastrophes on Earth were World War I that happened between July 1914 and November 11, 1918 with 20 million deaths and World War II that was fought between 1914 and 1918, with 50 million human death. There were other flu, plague, pandemics and epidemics that ruined human and other living beings. All losses that happened before mankind were mostly natural, whereas all damages that occurred post-human arrival were born through human-made. This implies that the earth is meant for a purpose. The purpose could be, to take away good humans to the next level of birth. What is next level of birth? This could be the birth in superior logas like Sorga Loga. Sorga Loga is the place where Pralayam has little influence. Now answering the question, what is the significance of Corona or COVID-19 in Earth's evolution? As per Nostradamus, ruler Kalki will take birth in India, where five rivers originate and surrounded by three oceans, possibly Maharashtra or Karnataka. Nostradamus also says that the ruler will visible as himself, after beginning of Third World War. If Corona or the COVID-19, is presumed to be the Third World War against the innocent human life, we may expect that at the beginning of 2025, as per the prediction of Nostradamus, the immortal Lord Kalki will be born. It was told that, though in the beginning he will be disliked by people, later he will receive a best of the best welcome, that the world had never seen in the past. In order to establish Sanatana Dharma and spirituality on whole world, Lord Kalki will kill nearly 80% to 85% of sinful people, who are found eating non-veg, showing hatred, greedy and selfish. In other words, all dead will become a level, to the rest of living humans for, how not to live. When approximate 75% of population will get his punishment, after then only he will show his Suyurupam, the real face of him, as a living god and, relieve the world from their problems. Now, all dead as sinners will have to take rebirth in the new Satya Yogam of the new earth, whereas, all good living beings will be taken to the next Punya Loga, like Sorga Loga and, be saved from the rebirth on earth, post Pralayam, or destruction of this earth. So, the significance of Corona or COVID-19 is, humans must go vegan and be graceful to the fellow living beings. Like, share, comment and subscribe if you like this video, thank you.